hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to bags in design by campers um to my existing subscribers welcome back to um campers designs to my new subscribers if you're new here welcome to bags in design by campers so guys today's video i'm gonna be showing you guys this lovely um step by step tutorial of this dashing laptop bag this is the second laptop bag with chocolates um pure leather laptop bag um, my previous video you can watch um, the first laptop bag um, where I made um, brown brown leather um, pure leather laptop bag so guys um, please watch this tutorial to the end this um, tutorial will be coming in two phases and this is the first step of this tutorial so guys Please watch out for the second step for a better understanding and guys please watch this tutorial to the end for better understanding it is a well detailed tutorial guys please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and also click on the notification button for updates of my videos like comment share my videos Thank you guys and God bless you. Guys, um, this is the pocket of the bag. So um, this particular design, it's just gonna be coming in one pocket. Uh, my previous video on um, the first laptop bag, which is um, the brown leather, um, has um, two pockets so this is only coming in one pocket and this is the measurement for the first um, pocket for the only pocket of the um laptop bag so you guys can you know see the um measurement and also work with the measurements guys um this particular bag this particular design comes in um the back comes in full and not in half so I'll this is the um, measurement for um, the back of the laptop bag. Guys, um, this is the front, the front body. The previous one I showed you just now is the um, back body. This is the first. Um, the front body of the laptop bag and um, the measurement is there for you guys to um, see and work with guys um, I'm gonna be joining this with a lining you know attached to um, the front pocket so for the front um, body of the bag um, the upside is going to be shaped and the you know the down parts doesn't need any shape so guys just work with this um, pattern and you will get it correctly guys um, this is um, a pattern this is a um, fiber pattern I make use of fiber to make my pattern and this is Marco you know you're just gonna work with a measurement and you know cut out your Marco and use your Marco um, inside the bag so you know it's gonna be an, a, a inner pocket for um, for the laptop guys this is the um, leather for um, the zip this is a zip measurement so I split it into two you know it's four by the time you split it it will go to um, the right will be two and the left will be two and you have your zip at the middle of it guys please like I said follow all follow this step you know follow every bit of the step that I made here and you'll be able to do it correctly even more than what I am doing it right now
guys this is a long strap you know the long strap has um, the weight is four and you can use any measurement for the length not necessarily that you have to go with this uh, measurement so you can just use any measurement for the length you know um, so guys the next thing I'm just gonna be talking about right now is to talk about the corset of the bag the corset that goes um, that has to do with the bottom and the two sides of the bag attach to the zip so the length is 37 and the width is 4 this is um, the measurement so you guys can work with it and also the measurement is a bit um, I mean I, I added a few inches to it so for it to be enough so if it is too much you can just you know trim it out and all that so um this is the undo order that comes in um you know i have to cut four letters you know for the undo order where you have your um adjuster so um the length is 13 and um the weight is two inches so by the time you fold it the weight has to be one inch so you cut four of that out and also this is a cord you know you have your cord you have your um this is a cord you wrap your cord with this you know just take any measurement for the length just make sure that um it will be enough to go round the leather so for the width you can use on um, one inch one inch for the width and you can use any inches for um, the length guys this is the handle also the handle of the bag comes in two um, pieces and um, the length is um, the length of the bag of the handle is 24 inches while um, the width is 2 inches so just follow this um, measurement and you get it correctly so um, guys the uh, at the center of the handle you have your wool so the wool will be on the center to give it that lovely shape and also guys I'll be working with few um, equipment like unstitch equipment and also um, the bag deering so guys this is the deering I'll be working with bronze chocolate leather bronze accessory and this is um, unstitch equipment of work for pressing a hole to the leather this is my zip guys um now we're starting with a job <laughs> uh so the width of the bag is um 17.5 or 17 inches depending but you know the middle the right the left by the time you take one inch um at the center the measurement has to be five 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 inches so i'm just you know trying to bring out where i'm gonna be putting my handle the back handle so i'm trying to um trying to mark it out so basically that is what i'm doing right now so um this um particular place that i'm rolling right now i just took one inch one inch you know from the both sides like i said aside from the place that i marked the middle the front um the left and the right has to be five five inches so guys um this is the front pocket of the bag we're working on the front pocket i'm so sorry um this particular design doesn't really need um adjuster so i'm just i'm not gonna be making use of adjuster so i'm just gonna be stitching everything i'm just gonna be stitching it completely you know adjusting all that so guys um where i marked 
not for undo so i'm just gonna stitch that in you know just follow me the way i am doing it right now and you'll get it correctly you guys will understand every full details of you know the whole thing so basically guys what i did was i just um attached glue to I just attached glue to the um, order and I folded it you know like I said earlier it is two inches I folded it to one inch and now I am stitching making use of my um, straight um, sewing machine my flatbed machine guys the next thing i'm gonna be doing right now is to attach uh, my lining i'm true with it I'm, and i'm just gonna attach my lining to because i'm trying to make a pocket right so i'm just gonna attach my lining and then i'm just gonna um, just stitch straight So now guys, I'm done stitching, I'm just stitching, so I'm just gonna fold it a little bit, some inches we have to go inside because I have to put my magnets and that is why I left that inches, it's so sorry, I, 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 I thought I said undo not undo guys, I mean, <laughs> I'm just gonna, you know, just fold it inside and then stitch. So now it's time for us to stitch. Like I said, guys, you need to leave some few inches, you know, aside from your lining. I hope you guys are getting me. I hope you guys are really understanding uh, this tutorial right now. So I'm just gonna stitch that straight. I'm just gonna stitch it straight. guys now the next thing is to um, fix the magnets uh, like I said earlier I'll be making use of um, a bronze accessory so I'm just gonna you know just um, look for the center and after looking for the center I'm just gonna notch it and you know just attach my or fix my um, magnet to it
now I'm through fixing the magnet so what I'm gonna be doing right now is just to stitch it round just to stitch um, the lining and the leather round Now I'm true with the pocket, so the next thing is to get my undo fix before doing any other thing. So guys, this is the handle, this is the equipment I'll be working with, you know, with the handle. So you just have to draw a little bit, a little bit of pattern, you know, just to give it a lovely shape that you actually need. The length of this pattern is um, 5.7 inches, you know, the width is um, 1 inch. So um, the down part is um, 1.6 inches, so basically I'm just, you know, applying gum to the leather board and I'm just going to glue it straight to the um, leather. What I'm doing right now guys is just to trim the letter a little bit just to give it that um, because I actually want to fold it well so I'll have to notch it a little bit at the both sides and now just apply my gum instead you know coming them together. Guys, I'm almost through with the with the gumming. So after folding it together, just use my hammer to hit it well, you know, just to, <laughs> to give it that lovely shape. So I'm just gonna hit it well. Now I'm almost through with the old handle. So basically, guys, right now what I'm doing is just to apply gum, and then you know after it's dried, and I'm just gonna fold the both edges, the both sides, the, the the left and the right. Then after folding it, I'm just gonna put my wool, and after putting my wool, and then I'm just gonna you know fold them together.
the measurement of the wall is 13 inches. Wow, guys, we drew with the folding. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, this is really, really nice. <laughs> now, the next thing to do is just to attach um, the wool, attach the wool, and after attaching the wool, then fold them together. Now we're true with the undo. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we're true with the undo. So um, basically right now guys, the next thing is to punch the hole, is to punch the hole by using um, the unstitch for. Guys, we're true with punching the hole and I'm true stitching the undo. Um, so guys, basically I'm just gonna stitch the undo to the main body of the bag. Like I said earlier guys, um, the left will be 5, the middle will be 5, and the other um, side should be 5 inches. That is how the measurement is. It has to be 5, 5, 5 inches. Now, right now, what I'm doing is I'm trying to unstitch, um, unstitch the leather, the under to the main body.
now guys and through um, stitching the under so right now you guys can see how beautiful and how lovely oh my gosh <laughs> right now so the next thing is just to stitch the uh, main body to the lining So now I'm true stitching the lining. So this is the back. The back I just um after stitching the handle, I stitch my um actually stitch the foam to heat and also the lining. So right now I'm about to um stitch um to join um the macro to the back using 2.5 inches. Guys, please watch out for the second phrase of this video where you have full knowledge about the whole making of this bag. So guys, um, this tutorial has come to an end and I hope you guys enjoyed um, this tutorial. Thank you guys for watching always and thank you for your support and your love. I'm so super grateful. So guys, <laughs> please. Don't forget to subscribe and also guys click on the notification button to get more updates from me and also please don't forget to like, comment, share and don't forget to always support me. Thank you guys and God bless you. I love you all.